what is going on everybody welcome back to brandon model for two video today we're taking a look at the pdsw 528 aka the p90 i got a banger set up for you guys along with two and crazy gameplays dropping mgb tac nukes and 100 plus kills so if you guys enjoyed the video give it a like subscribe those notifications turned on and let's get into it so first thing of course we got the pdsw 528 we have our p890s our secondary the stem shot for our tactical we also have the semtex for our lethal and our perk package goes as follows double time scavenger fast hands and quick fix uh, overall this is a fantastic perk package to be able to run if you're trying to go for those high kill gameplays those nukes you know stuff like that uh definitely definitely recommend this and then for the field upgrade we have our munitions box but now let's actually get into the pdsw so first thing on here is actually going to be the f tax series ix 14.5 barrel this is gonna give us damage range hip fire accuracy movement speed and bullet velocity this is a really great barrel to be able to run on this thing it's gonna slay down here a little bit uh, in terms of your aim down sight speed and it's gonna negatively affect your recoil control just a little bit but i realistically didn't notice it all that much um i believe it kicks up just a little bit but it's definitely worth it in terms of it because it's going to make this gun so so much better um then the tune on this thing here is going to be a 0 0.11 or negative 0 0.11 on that left side and then a 0 0.30 a negative 0 0.30 on the bottom so definitely try this out here uh by the way for the tuning on these things you don't necessarily want to max everything out uh that's pretty much what we were doing initially and that actually can have a pretty detrimental effect to the attachment and you'll find that there's kind of a point of diminishing return you start like really negatively affecting the rest of the gun when you start really maxing stuff out so it's kind of like weird and doesn't make sense but um that's just kind of how it works after that though we're gonna go straight over here to the optics section since we'll be focusing more so on the back side of the gun uh we have the chrome to mini pro so this is going to be the blue dot red dot sight uh pretty much what i mean by that is that this is going to be the site you get for uh leveling up the expedite shotguns level seven uh you have to do that in order to be able to unlock the blue dot site for this gun and this is actually a really really fun uh site to be able to use definitely my favorite one in the game right now and then the tune on this thing here is actually going to be a negative 1.55 on that left side because i want to get a little bit more ads speed out of it and also i didn't necessarily mess with the optic tuning but if you guys want your gun to feel a little bit more zoomed out you can actually move it all the way over to that far side and pretty much what that does is that pushes the sight away from you instead of if you too close then you bring the sight closer to you and it'll take up more of your screen so depending on what you feel like you're good with i definitely go for that but otherwise i just kept it pretty much like straight down the middle right here and i haven't really messed with it i felt it was perfectly fine that way but otherwise you guys could definitely try probably pushing it a little bit away wouldn't be necessarily a bad idea um after that we're gonna go to the stock section the cqb stock uh, crouch movement speed sprint speed and aim down sight speed we don't really care about the crouch movement speed that's not necessarily something we're you know concerned with i don't like camp i don't do any of that sort of shenanigans i don't really care about that um i pretty much just care about the sprint speed and aim down sight speed without messing up my gun too too much and so that's why we've gone for this um the tune on this is going to be an all the way maxed out for aim down sight speed as you can actually do that without messing up the attachment in the rest of the gun then we have a plus 1.32 there on the bottom so definitely try out this variation here for this tune the comb section that we're going to use the tv tacom b tacom whatever you want to call this thing uh pretty much this could give a sprint and fire speed aim down sight speed a really really solid attachment uh, i absolutely love having you know a gun that's super agile super mobile and specifically because this is an smg we definitely need that to be the case um the tune on this is going to be left at zero zero there on that left side just because i really didn't feel like i was going to benefit from kind of messing with some of that stuff and then we maxed out or we actually got closer to maxing out on the bottom there with a negative 0.14 so you guys could probably try something out here if you really want to mess around with the tune here but otherwise i mean it, it, this is just like a weird attachment where it doesn't really feel like it gets that much better by doing one thing or the other i mean maybe you could try it for aim walking speed but otherwise i mean you'd probably just leave it at like zero zero and then for our final attachment here we got the bruin q900 grip uh this is going to be an incredible grip to run on this thing sprint to fire speed and aim down sight speed we just really sped this gun up here quite a bit uh absolutely love that and you're gonna lose a tad of that recoil control but like i said it's really not a hard gun to build control at all this is for close to mediumish range and the tune on this thing here is going to be a 0 0.42 negative 0 0.42 and then negative 0 0.25 there on the bottom so this is my full build here for the pdsw528 let's actually hop into the firing range so you can show you guys this here real quick and how this actually performs as this is a really really solid gun so i mean look at that very very easy to control you just have to pull down a little bit on the stick and otherwise i mean you're pretty much just good to go just gonna bounce around a little bit at that medium -ish range but of course we're trying pretty much just going for that closest range and it's just a very very good gun with that being said i got some incredible gameplay don't go anywhere you're not gonna want to miss it it's action-packed all the way through to the very end bro i'm telling you reloading in this game if you get caught in middle reload have fun Ooh.
All right, let's get that UAV going. We need to see where these guys are going to be at. Well, that solves one issue. Is that guy going to go for me? Wait. Oh my god, dude. I don't know how I just got that right there. Picked off the heady and everything. Alright, we're just calling this in because I need to see where people are coming from. So they're at least going to be on this side here. This P90 setup hits. Well, I call it the P90, but it's the, the PDSW. One guy was AFK there, but the other one's chewed stuff down. Bro, what are you doing? Alright, we're gonna let him sit on that point there for a sec. Naturally, naturally. I, I made a bit of a ballsy chow. Died. That's just how it is sometimes. Wait, what? Oh, look the other way. Oh my god. I'm just running through people. Alright, let's call this in. Oh, that sun. And I could have done, I could have definitely got those guys. Get the street going. That's my fault, kind of. It was marking somebody over there. The support helo is super clutch. It actually marks people. He spawned back here? Oh, they all did. Oh, that drill charge? Called the UAV in. Nice little flank around back that real, really helped. Oh, that almost has got me. There we go. Can I call this in? Airspace too crowded. Dude, every single time, I swear to God, I get the advance, get the streak, we die. Got that guy. Wait. I stopped shooting. All right, well, still got him anyways. We're definitely flying to these guys though. Ooh! I'm telling you, bro. This gun is this gun is really good. This thing is really, really good. We got the advanced again. All right, calling the other advance. Guess what? Another one's going up.
all needs that my teammates not to like directly sit on it. Come on, teammates, don't sit on it entirely. I don't even know what streak I'm on, man. Come on, something though. All right, no idea, no idea. Bro, if I don't get this, Oh, I got it. I got it. I got it. Holy crap. I was just stressing there. Oh my God. I can't believe I just got that. Wow. The struggle I was just going through. The stress. Oh, all paid off. There we go. Beautiful. Beautiful. Love to see it. All right, let's see where these fellas are at. I only know where he was. Are they spawning back there? Yeah, probably. Is that a nade launcher? Oh, hell no. Wait. What? Bro, they're all just gathered like right there. Holy crap, dude. Hey, this is a crazy looking room. Oh, yeah, we're gonna go ridiculous in this match. I can feel it. I nice. hope I still got blown up by whatever that BS he's using. In the corner. Bro, I don't know what's going on here. All right, we need uh need this UAV going up. That makes my life a lot easier. Naturally, I. I run right at their spawn, bro. I get the advance and die. Classic, uh, classic Chuck move. Actually, I did not mean to call that. I just happened to get that. We're gonna get the advance going, actually. Yo, what are you doing over here, brother man? Oh, we can probably catch him off guard here. Man, he just kind of ran straight at me there. I give him props to that. So they're down below. They're kind of like holding each other. Oh my god, this person almost just beamed me, dog. There you go, gotten another advance as soon as the other one went away. Let the UAV go for a sec. Guess you guys, I want to be able to see levels of where they're at. With the advance, you can't. Oh, Jesus, dude. Alright, we're calling that in. 
I need to see where, what's going on. He's running around inside here. Ain't no way. I'm real lost. How is he not showing up on the advance? Does ghost or something like keep you off advance? We're going up top here. There we go. On a 25. All right, cool. Actually saw that. Normally I don't be seeing those things. Hey mates, what was going on over here, huh? Don't know where they're all coming from, so. Oh, and well, hey, there's the MGB, baby. That's what I'm talking about. Oh my god, dude, this has been this has been a fire game so far. I don't know where I died from. Oh, he's laying prone. Only one thing left to do, basically, besides kind of call that MGB and his. Dude, that could have gone. That could have been such a disgusting feed. Uh, we gotta make sure that we potentially try to drop another. This P90. I called a P90, but it's like. Uh, I mean, it really is. It's it, that's pretty much what it is. It's they call it the PDSW A or whatever it's called, but I just call it P90. Everyone in the mom knows that's what it is. Bro, are people like leaving the game. All right, let's make sure we get the Overwatch Hilo in. This gun's not fully reloaded. All right, throw down that ammo. That worked out pretty nice. Real close to getting that advance. Dang, I, I, I couldn't react fast enough to that guy down there. That's a bit tragic. Uh, what we're gonna do, gotta make sure to call that in. If you guys are wondering why I'm doing this, it's just because it's like, when you have an MGB in your pocket, you're potentially trying to go for another streak. Your character can like skip over the fact that like, you have another thing in line just to do call on the MGB. We're going off. All right. We're not going to do that though. Counter UAV. All right, calling the sporty low. Airspace too crowded. What do you mean airspace too crowded? There you go. We should be real close to advance. Yeah, one off. Dude. I, I heard there was a shot from behind and I was like, oh, I got to go prone. Man. Um, that bum kid over there. I just took out the grenade. Man. What in the hell? There we go, baby. We're doing some serious work this game. Okay, yep. UAV, please. Don't call that in just yet. Oh, man. Okay, well, we got the Overwatch. Happy about that. All right, we're just going to go for it. 
Oh, we actually didn't call the MGB. I'm surprised. This P90 with that red dot is just so lethal. Iron sides are just like a tad bit awkward. It's like you don't want to use them almost. They're not bad, but they just like could be a lot better. All right, we're calling that in. Yep. Nice. Two forty four. Actually, we gotta call this in right now. I just his teammates are on that thing, and they're gonna they're gonna get the cap out at two fifty. Yes, sir. Calling this bad boy in. Oh my goodness. And one last kill there before the MGB goes off. Too bad I won't take out anybody in terms of kills, but we got 106 kills. MGB tack nuke with that beautiful, beautiful PDSW.